Hello friends, welcome back. In this video, I'll show you how to delete an administrator account in Windows 11. Whether it's a local account or a Microsoft account, I'll guide you through each method. Make sure to watch till the end so you don't miss any important details. Before deleting any user account, always back up any important data. If the account has files you might need, like documents, photos or downloads, make sure to save them to an external drive or cloud storage. To delete an administrator account, you must be signed in with another admin account. If you don't have another admin, you need to create one. Open the Settings app. Click on Accounts. Then select Other Accounts. Choose Add Account. It will ask you to sign in with a Microsoft account. If you want to use a local account instead, just click on I don't have this person sign in information. Then select add a user without a Microsoft account. Set up a new local account. Now click change account type to make it an administrator. Once the new administrator account is ready, press Windows plus L on your keyboard to lock your PC. This will take you to the login screen. Select the newly created administrator account and sign in. Now that you are signed in with another admin account, it's time to delete the old admin account. First, open the task manager. Go to the Users tab. Right-click on the old admin account and choose Sign Off. This ensures the old account is fully signed out. Now, go to Settings. Then Accounts. And click on Other Users. Locate the old administrator account you want to delete. Click on it and then click Remove. A confirmation will appear asking if you want to delete the account and data. Click delete account and data to proceed. And that's it. You have successfully learned how to delete an administrator account in Windows 11.